Howdy, my name's Edward, and I'm the president of Valarm. This is a Yachtipuse Wi-Fi hub connected to environmental sensors for monitoring temperature, humidity, pressure, air quality, volatile organic compounds, or VOCs, and light. In this video, you will see how to link a Yachtipuse hub device, such as a Wi-Fi or Ethernet hub, to the Valarm Tools cloud at tools.valarm.net. After you've created a Valarm Tools account and have purchased credits, you can use the Create an API Device button under Device Manager. Give your device a nickname. Here I'm naming it after which facility and room the device will be remotely monitoring. Select Open Post as the type for Yachtipuse Hub devices. Now, once you're viewing your API device on tools.valarm.net, you'll configure the sensor map. To get the sensor IDs, you'll use Yachtipuse's Virtual Hub software, which you can download on their website if you haven't already. Using Virtual Hub, connect to your local Yachtipuse Hub in your web browser, and then click the Configure button for the sensor you'd like to map to the Valarm Tools Cloud. In the sensor configuration, you'll see the device's sensor. In this case, Medio MK1-08744, You'll use each of these device function names back in the Valarm tools under Configure Sensor Map. For the sensor ID, type in your sensor's name, followed by the hash, pound, or number sign, and then the sensor's name. Next, select the sensor channel from the drop-down list. In this case, I'm configuring the sensor map for humidity first. Do the same for each of your sensors using the plus button to add each additional sensor. In this case, I'll also configure the temperature and barometric pressure sensor channels. Once you've finished the Valarm tool sensor mapping, click the Get API URL button in the upper right part of your device's page. This launches the API URL dialog for your device. Copy this URL to your clipboard, then you'll paste this URL into the configuration for your Yachtipuse hub. Back in your virtual hub connection, click the Configure button of your Yachto hub. At the bottom of the configuration page, click the Edit button next to Callback URL. Select a user-defined callback, then paste the URL from Valarm Tools Cloud into the Callback URL text box. Remember to delete an extra HTTP colon slash slash if there is one at the beginning of your URL. You'll use the HTTP POST method and www form URL encoded data encoding. At the bottom, you can configure how often you would like to upload sensor readings. Here I've specified to upload sensor values to Valarm Tools Cloud every 10 seconds if there's a change in readings. And if there's no change in the factors, then upload an alert every 10 minutes so I know the hub and sensors are still alive. That's it. Now click OK and save your settings and go back to tools.valarm.net. While viewing your Yachto Hub device, you can select from and to dates using a calendar to specify from which time interval you'd like to see your sensor data. Use analytical mapping and Esri Arc GIS tools to perform mapping, visualization, and spatial analysis of your sensor data. You can download your sensor data in CSV or KML format for further analysis and visualization. Also, you can graph your sensor data as you see here with sample temperature and humidity data. See Valarm's other videos for more tutorials on how to use Valarm to do things like share your sensor data using Valarm's APIs to publish JSON, GeoRSS, and other feeds. Please don't hesitate to contact us at info at if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for another video.